It's the world's fastest growing religion, Islam. But Islam will grow faster than any other major religion. Islam remains the fastest growing religion. The headlines say Islam is going to be the largest religion in the world. The latest U.S. census suggests many of them are turning to Islam. In fact, an estimated 20,000 Americans each year become Muslims. In the last year, around 5,200 people in Britain converted to Islam. As many as 100,000 have converted in the last decade. One of the world's largest religions is gaining followers from a very unlikely community. A growing number of Hispanics are changing their religion and following the teachings of Islam. Islam is growing faster than ever. Islam is the only religion growing faster than the world's population. Growing numbers of white British women are converting to Islam. I don't know if you're aware, but recently there's been a rise of Latinas converting into Islam. So why are they doing it? So what's going on? What is compelling so many young white women to convert to Islam? Despite all that, it's estimated that last year around 5,000 people converted to Islam in the UK. Over half were white, and three quarters of them were women. Islam is the only non-Christian faith which makes it an article of faith to believe in Jesus Christ, peace be upon him. No Muslim is a Muslim if he does not believe in Jesus Christ, peace be upon him. We believe that he was the Messiah translated Christ. We believe that he was born miraculously without any male intervention, which many modern Christians today do not believe. We believe that he gave life to the dead with God's permission. We believe that he healed those born blind and lepers with God's permission. In fact, she says it was Jesus himself who led her to Islam. You think Jesus led you to become a Muslim? Yes, yes. You were a Catholic priest for nine years, wasn't it? W with my training, yes. Yeah. Why did you decide to convert? Here in the United States, while the Muslim contingent numbers an estimated seven to eight million, it's growing rapidly. 20,000 new converts each year, four times as many women as men. In what is now the fastest growing religion in the world. For perspective, as of tonight, there are 1.5 billion Muslims. And check this out. According to that same population projection, Muslims are the only major religious group expected to grow faster than the global population as a whole. But Islam has actually been attracting more and more Americans every day. That may be no surprise, since a quarter of the estimated 6 million Muslims in the United States are converts. But she left the church and converted, and today, Angela Collins is Muslim. Islam is the fastest growing religion in the UK. New analysis of census figures even suggests that it could become the country's dominant religion in as little as 10 years' time. The number of Muslims in the UK has doubled in the past decade. I don't think it's right to identify Islam with violence. This is not just and it's not true. Islam is a religion that preaches peace and the overwhelming majority of Muslims are peaceful. Muslims are peaceful and tolerant people and have nothing whatsoever to do with terrorism. When we think of Islam, we think of a faith that brings comfort to a billion people around the world. Islam is peace. Twenty years ago, there were just over a billion Muslims in the world. Twenty years from now, there will be just over two billion. According to the Pew Forum on Religion and Public Life, the number of Muslims in the United States will more than double by 2030. The name exalted over and over in Islam is Jesus. I was told that Jesus is the Messiah who will come back at the end of time to establish the kingdom of justice and peace. Not Muhammad? Not Muhammad, the Christ, son of Mary. Chapter 19 in the Quran is, is titled Surah Maryam, which means the chapter of Mary. It is an exclusive chapter that is named after the mother of Jesus Christ, Mary. And that is also another tenet of Islam that you must believe that Mary was the greatest woman and the most pious woman ever. That is our, the, she, when it comes to women, Mary is on top of the list as being the one who we believe is the most pious woman ever on the face of the planet and that is a tenet of our faith to believe in Mary that she was pious and that she was born she was a virgin when she had Jesus Christ and this this if anyone wants to read the true what they call the the nativity story you know the story of Jesus birth go read chapter 19 of the Quran it will make you cry it will make you cry because it made me cry the first time I read it because it's nothing like the Bible 
it is in a more beautiful tone of language and a more soft spoken and a more true manner than you can have ever read in any other book. You converted from Christianity to Islam. Why do you believe Islam is right? Now the obvious question really is, what is behind this high rate of conversion? What, what prompted your decision to convert to Islam?